They came out with another Purge movie this past week. I don't know if anybody went out and saw it. Anybody like the Purge? Anybody go see it? That's the only you can just... <laughs> One person gave a half-hearted boo just because they felt bad, I think. I don't think, I don't think they actually saw it. Uh, before I knew what The Purge was, I assumed it was a documentary about eating disorders. <laughs> and I was right. <laughs> no, a friend explained it to me. They were like, imagine a world where the government passes a law. I said, too unrealistic. <laughs> they said, bear with me. Imagine a world where the government passes a law where all crime is legal for 12 hours one day out of every year. And of course it would be, you know, that's crazy, right? People die in cities burning down, jaywalking everywhere, just in my <laughs> Um, who, who, who pretended, who, who said who when I asked who saw it? Did you, did you actually see any of the Purge movies? I saw the first one. The first one? Did you like it? I had mixed feelings. Too Purgy or not Purgy enough? <laughs> a little too Purgy for my taste. A little too Purgy, okay, that's fine. If I could ask you a question, what would be, like, your dream purge? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it doesn't say anything for the next 12 seconds, all answers are legal. I'm the president of the United States. Oh, that's it, that's, you would be the president of the United States, and you would write all these laws and take all these actions that don't mean anything because it's purge day, they don't do anything. Okay, that's cool. Um, being the president is actually totally legal. It's not a crime. <laughs> it's not a crime to be the president. <laughs> crime surrounding, we're not going to talk about it, but... Okay, and you know what? That's fine. Like, a lot of people, I feel like, would not go crazy, like you see in the trailer for those movies. Uh, I feel like a lot of people, you know, they'd be, like, driving somewhere with their spouse, and the, you know, the guy's like, oh, nice blinker, buddy! And his wife turns to him like, honey, it's purge day, remember? And he's like, oh my gosh, is that today? Like, well shoot, we gotta, we gotta celebrate. We're not stopping at any stop signs, unless there are actually cars coming, because that's just reckless. I mean, we want to be safe. We, but seriously though, we gotta get home now before things start happening. I mean, we gotta be ready to pirate some movies. And have we filed our taxes yet? Let's not report online purchases, because today's the day to do it. I'm just kidding, guys. You don't have to wait till Purge Day to not report that. They don't know. <laughs> oh, IRS is overworked as it is. That's not a joke. That's just real life. Yeah. Yeah, you heard me. You know, friends of, friends of mine who, who liked those movies, they'll be like, Joe, you don't understand, right? The movies are a commentary on, like, you know, like, class wars and poverty and all these things, and I'm like, what is this, anime? Like, stop making these deep metaphors in movies and shows with ridiculous premises, okay? I'm not smart, I don't understand them. <laughs> You're wasting your time, is what I'm trying to say, okay? I like movies about sharks and tornadoes and tornadoes of sharks, all right? I had to watch, I watched, I didn't have to, I chose to because I'm woke. I watched the video for This Is America, and then I had to watch a separate video to explain what I just watched. And so did you stop lying. 